Welcome back to the Hurley Pro Sunset Beach. Gabe Medina, Griffin Colapinto facing off and going to battle for a spot in the quarterfinals. Round of 16, heat number four. It is hard. It is. It's hard to make a pick right from the beginning, you know, and we can look at the past history with Gabe versus Griff. Uh, we're going to get back to some stats because three-time world champ's up. He's out. He's won uh, three times against Griffin. Griffin has beaten uh, Gabe most recently. We'll give him the lead. Griffin Colapinto, first wave against Gab Gabe Medina. And Colapinto, something grabbed his rail there. Wow, that's one of the longer boards. Medina mining in the barrel, and the cave collapses on the three-time world champ. He just kind of turned a mediocre wave into a good score. Gabby, getting scrappy right here, trying to take off on that one. Maybe just a little bit of repositioning for Gabriel Medina in the non-priority heat against Griffin Colapinto. Small scores only in non-priority heat. Uh, nobody's broken a two between Gabe Medina and Griffin Colapinto. <laughs> Laura and I were talking earlier about how Ethan looks so strong this year. Uh, he just looks like he put on like an extra 20 pounds of muscle in yeah. each turn that he's doing. Uh, and it's really exciting to watch. But this happened during the break. We're going to go with Griffin Cola Pinto on this ride. This is a 4.5, Megan. Yeah, nice first turn. Backs it up there. Utilizing uh, his priority, Gabe Medina off the bottom, booking it off the top, Laura. Majeen's one more time, but gets bounced. And it's in his uh, his bloodline. You know, I mean, his dad, great surfer out here. Griffin Colapinto, nice layback hack, and that's all he's going to get. Just needs a 2.27 to turn the heat for the moment. Probably got that on that one turn. And then looks like we're, this wave of games is interesting. Uh, he goes straight up into the lip. Uh, and then right here just had to, doesn't have much time to get straight back into another turn, um, but navigated that really well. This is exciting, and Griffin, he is in the hot seat holding priority at the moment. There's not a lot between this heat at the moment. You know, these two, as we see Griff on the offense. Cola Pinto eases through that first car, steeper on the inside here, aims towards the lip. Attacks the lip, gets the board right underneath his feet. One more time for Griffin and plants that third turn. As we see Griff take off, nice wave here. One of the more beautiful waves we've seen of this heat. Sizzling first calf here and just perfectly timed. This is where it got hard. He went th straight through the lip there and straight up again. Hung on. Look how thick and wobbly that lip is. He was so happy with that. It takes a lot of discipline uh, to go from that first turn into a, a lip line floater turn like he just did. I don't even know what to call it. That was crazy out of the sky surfing that he just did out of himself. And each wave, he just drops from like five feet above the, the bottom of the wave. He's going to flip this heat right now. Gabe Medina needs to answer back. Starts off with a hook under the lip. Caught a little bit behind and late to the party there has to throw it away. Yeah, unbelievable there. And Gabby just here tried to do the same thing. Look how boldly this section went. He was waiting for his opportunity to try to strike up and jump into the lip there. And unfortunately, tried to float this section. He got on top of it, which was wild that he even could get there. But unfortunately, just had to eject. I don't really think it matters that he has a couple more inches on his board because it's allowing him to keep that rail engaged the entire time. Hunting Gabe Medina under the priority of Griffin Cola Pinto, who's got maybe in Medina in a little bit of, um, I wouldn't say a panic, but certainly a concern because Medina needs to get X. 5.17 for that wave that we saw in the replay of Seth Moniz, Seth trailing Felipe Toledo. Gabby just easing through this, looking behind him. Um, this could be just some cat and mouse, maybe some reposition. A little too little, a little too late for Gabe Medina. Does he get to his feet? It was too late. Yeah, I think it was a second too late, right, Laura? Yeah, it was. All right. Well, it's done and dusted. Griffin Cola Pinto on to the quarterfinals. Gabe Medina knocked out of competition.